Welcome to my channel. I'm A-Day, otherwise known as Black Carnivore, and I'm coming to you from a slightly different scene. I wanted to make sure that you get a chance to see Brooklyn, New York, and see what carnivore life is like here in the big city. Anyway, today I want to talk about something that uh, it's a little delicate. So the question is, when you're getting started on a carnivore and you get what do you do about it? Why is it happening? That's what we're going to talk about in today's video. So before we get started, I want you to hit the like button, subscribe, and click the little bell icon so you can get notification every time I go live. So the question I get a lot of times is, uh, you know, I'm, I'm started on the carnivore diet. I'm four or five days in. I love it. Um, I'm eating great. And, uh, but you know, I'm having this diarrhea. What's going on? How, how do I handle that? So there's actually a couple of possibilities, but I'm only going to talk about one today. And that is trying to eat too much protein at one sitting. So I see a couple of things happening and I really think it has to do with, uh, you know, a couple of myths that are like floating around the carnivore community. One, you see pictures on Instagram of people sitting down to these ginormous, delicious looking, uh, you know, ribeye steaks that look, you know, to be about two, maybe even two and a half pounds. And you think that they're eating it all in one sitting. Some people do that, but a lot of people don't or you know they make one and then you know they eat as much as they can and then at the next meal eat the rest of it so that's a big possibility you know another thing is people are trying to incorporate fasting too soon so if you're trying to do omad or um, you know or uh, time restricted eating or even multi day fasts it just you know you just might not be able to incorporate that in the beginning with carnivore uh, give yourself a chance to get used to the diet and then, you know, after a while, bring back in fasting as, you know, as your appetite, you know, uh, dictates. And then another thing that might be going on is um, if you've just come from a, a you know, a, a high carb diet or you have been taking a lot of heartburn medication, which reduces the stomach acidity, you might not be able to, you might not have enough stomach acid to actually digest all of that protein. And then finally, you might be a person who has a small stomach or, you know, you've had surgery or some kind of, um, you know, condition that makes your stomach really small and you're just not able to eat all that much at once so you know those are some possible reasons why um, you might be trying to get too much now I have another video called uh, common problems common solutions and it goes through a lot of the problems that people have in the beginning of carnivore and that'll give you more detail but for right now as it pertains to protein just eat less you know I tell you of course don't snack so don't snack but you can eat more meals that one, you know, in a day. You don't have to try to do one meal or two meals. You know, it might be better as you're starting off to eat, you know, eight ounces of protein and have four meals in a day than it is to try to eat two pounds of meat. So that would be my recommendation, number one. And then number two, um, you know, don't drink so much water with your meals. You know, don't drink 30 minutes before, during, or after your meal because, um, you know, you don't want to dilute your stomach acid. And then make sure to salt your food liberally. Salt is part of, uh, you know, your, your body uses salt to make hydrochloric acid, which is the acid in your stomach to digest food. So if you're not using enough, you're, it, it's going to be hard to make enough, you know, for that meal. So uh, I would start with that. And if that doesn't work, you know, definitely check out that other video, Common Problems, Common Solutions, or, you know, reach out to me. It might make more sense for you to do some coaching and actually, you know, kind of get into the particulars of your problem. We can do a 15 minute consultation where a free consultation where we can discuss if it's right for you and, uh, you know, go from there. But I am so excited that so many of you are trying carnivore and giving it a shot. And I wish you the best of success. Carnivore for the culture.